In today's episode of Tech Quickies, I'm going to show you how to completely unroot your Android phone or tablet directly from your device itself. It's a universal one-click unroot method and moreover, it's a no data loss method which means all of your apps and files on your device are safe. And unlike many other tutorials online in which you'll have to go to the root directory of your device and then delete a bunch of files and all, which is not only risky if you don't know what you're doing, but it may lead to a permanent brick. This video, however, is going to show you a super easy one-click unroot method which should work on any Android device out there. And it's a very safe process. Let's get started. Step number one, locate your root manager app. No matter how you got your device rooted, it's gonna have one of these apps. Either it's gonna have the super sue app or it can have the king user, king root or super user app. All of them are quite similar, acting as the root manager on your device. Now, if you have super sue installed on your device, then simply open it up. Then go to the app settings, which should be at the extreme right corner. Then you'll need to scroll down all the way down until you see the clean up tab. And under the cleanup tab, you will find a full unroot option. Then simply tap on that. And do read the disclaimer here and do make a note that some Android custom ROMs and kernels might refuse to unroot as they need root access to function and will reroute your device every time you reboot. So make sure that you're aware of this. Once you're done with that, tap on the continue button. And you're done. It might take a couple of minutes to unroot your device, but after that, the Super Sue app will automatically force close, then simply restart your device and boom, you're unrooted. Now, if you have the King User, King Root or Super User app, all of them are quite similar, acting as the root manager on your device, then the process is quite similar to Super Sue. First of all, open the app up. Then locate the settings menu. Depending on the version of the app that you're using, it's either gonna be a gear icon at the top right corner or it can be three dots or something similar. Once you have located the settings, open it up. Again, depending on the version of the app that you're using, the uninstall root or remove root option will either be here in the list or it can be found inside the root authorization settings. Now, since I'm using the latest version of King Root, I have it here in the list. Once you find that, simply tap on it. Again, make sure to read the disclaimer here. After you're done with that, hit on the continue button. Usually unrooting through King Root is a bit faster than Super Sue. And after the process is completed, the app will close, then simply restart your device and boom, bye bye root. Now, some of you might find the root manager icon on your device even after the unrooting process is done. But by simply restarting your device again or by normally dragging and uninstalling the app icon will fix the issue. And in order to ensure that your device is truly unrooted, you can get this free app from Play Store called as Root Checker and check whether your device is unrooted or not. If you followed the instructions correctly and had restarted your device after unrooting, then it should look something like this. And on a final note, if you have any burning questions about unrooting, then do check the FAQ sections in the description box under this video. And feel free to send me a hi in the comments. I do read and try to reply to each one of your questions and comments. And with that, we had concluded the third episode of Tech Quickies. If you missed the first two episodes of Tech Quickies, then you can either click here or you can check the links under the thumbs up button. And do give this video a big juicy thumbs up if this video helped you in any means. And do subscribe if you want to watch more interesting quick videos like this one. So yup, that's about it. I'm your host HK from The Android Guy signing off. And I hope you guys have a great day. Peace.